What's going on, YouTube people, car enthusiasts, and 3D printer enthusiasts? We're going to wrap it all up in this one episode. Look at those spider webs. Oh, damn it, I missed it. Oh, look, I'm bleeding. Oh, I just walked through that spider web. Ah, oh, jeez. To be honest, I expected a huge gush of water to come out. Well, it didn't kill us, so that's a plus. Today, we are back in my 1993 Mazda Miata. If you remember these block off plates that we made before, here you can see the other side. I haven't painted those screws, but I will be today, because in today's episode, we are going to be replacing this. This is normally where you would mount your rear view mirror. Uh, this car never had one. Well, it never came with one. I'm sure it came with one from the factory. But it should be simple enough to replace. It's a couple of countersunk holes and a standard block off plate. So let's go ahead and model that part up. So I've gone ahead and removed everything that was up there. It was the two screws, that locking clip for the receiver, and then the plastic piece. What I'm going to do is replicate this white plastic piece as just a flat plate with two holes in it because I tried threading the screws in and they can go all the way in. They don't hit anything. So there's no need for me to make the countersunk holes. By not spending any extra time making the material thicker so I can put those countersunk holes in, we should be able to make a very thin plastic part very quickly. Now that we have SolidWorks loaded up, let's draw our rectangle and our two holes. The only thing that matters is the diagonal distance between these two holes which, well, if you look at it like this, it's just gonna be a straight line. That's the only critical dimension for this whole part. So let's model it up. and displayed in the right configuration, let's save it to our removable drive. So, here's our part, all done. Let's let it cool down and we'll pry it off the bed. So, here's our part, all done. The holes line up really well. So let's go ahead and give it a quick shot of paint. Now that our parts are all dry, let's go and install them. And I do apologize, but it is nighttime now. Now that our part is installed, everything looks nice and flush. Let's see if we can use the light. Mm. Nice panoramic of everything. That's damn good filming there, Andrew. But what's this? The moon, because I'm in a convertible. Dark side of the moon, bruh. Anyway, that's gonna wrap up this episode of Do Something Every Day 2. I hope you've enjoyed watching this episode. I sure had a lot of fun making it. It's weird when people say that, isn't it? Anyway, if you check out the description below, you should be able to find two different websites where I uploaded this model for free. So please go ahead, like it, subscribe, do whatever you want. I hope you enjoyed it and we will see you on the next episode. I'm starting to acquire a lot of extra Miata parts. If you need anything, send me a private message and I'll be happy to get back to you with a decent price. Oh look, mozzarella sticks.